part of the coalition government as the chair of the court. Ever since I got into this job, I've been determined that we establish a process that gets to the truth of what happened. And this is a hill to a star inquiry, and I think there's a common view that that was a very effective process to get into the truth of what happened. And with that settling, I think we can achieve the same result. The bishop's now urging other families to come forward if they have any concerns. It's extremely unusual. I mean, as well as the medical experts helping the bishop here, there's also an investigative journalist, David Penn, and a former Scotland Yard commander, Duncan Janice. Now, some of the team did work together on the Hillsborough Inquiry. But the government who set up this independent inquiry claims they do not want any stone left I'm absolutely the Now, the panel is urging people to come forward. Uh, we have those details on the ITV Millennium website. Uh, the panel wants to find answers. This inquiry could last two to three years. And it's not very much. Meanwhile, the relatives of eight people who died while living in a care home in West Sussex are to receive compensation. There were 19 unexplained deaths at the Orchid View Home in Cockburn between 2009 and 2011. The coroner ruled the home was dismantled out of staff and riddled with abuse, and that five of the deaths involved neglect.